Onivia League of Legends highlights. Yes, this is a lane that has <gasps> a lot of harrow. Oh! No way. Oh, he's doing it! The Zyra lock in in the bot lane. And Atlas. But uh, Sylvie doesn't want to push it, wants to play it safe. And now Sylvie's in mid, and Call Me just dies. So, Sylvie trying to help. And it feels like KT have just been hard forced. Oh, they thought he backs. Peter in a lot of trouble here. No heal. That's the Ignite to take down. But Sylvie was here, so they should be able to get one kill back. As Dev just trying to trade it onto Jiwoo will not be successful. Which obviously opens up an opportunity now, though. BDD. Uh oh, BDD just face checking. He's going to flash, and he's got Pyoshik nearby, though. And now Call Me. Low on mana, they're just going to turn off to Sylvie here as Pyoshik waiting for it. The flash Q comes in and Sylvie's just going to flash away. As now flash oh. forward here is Jiwoo trying to get this kill on a death, but I don't know if he's got the longevity to continue to chase down the lane. And now he's up against an ass and he can't get away. And he's going to go down as death will pick up that kill. The damage just wasn't... Um, I guess we're going to see this game, how it sort of pans out when it comes to team fights. I feel like when you're picking the Zyra, obviously, lane going well like this is... Ooh. You know who needs cleanse? When you can just ghost and sidestep. <laughs> just ghost it, yeah. Just move faster. Uh, Ghostic's certainly taking that to heart, as Call Me is dead. Um, this time, you're not getting away, as it seems like BDD and Ghostic are able to put two and two together with their ultimates. Flash on in, as Sylvie will flash away. Barrel just hoping to get in on some of the action. Being against a Zyra, even though there is no ultimate available. Yeah, flash available. The wall's going to come in as uh, Pyoshik go for a little ride there. Not sure about that. As now he's in the pit. He's like, oh god, I don't have flash either. And he's in a lot of trouble. Damage finally comes through. Dendon gets over the wall. As it looks like HT want to take a 4v5. They're all stuck in the pit. But the poke damage is coming in. They've got them in a perfect position. As now BE just going to sweep the ball up. Once the rocks go down, Jiu desperate to try to help, but it's not going to work. The arrow's right on point, and KT will clean them up. Like fish, like crazy amount of that. Oh. Uh, okay, that's a uh, play. Yeah. And Barrel now with the Leandries and the Zaxak is going to be doing like a crazy amount of that. Oh. Uh, okay, that's uh, you're in a lot of trouble here as down he will go. Zyralt. Thrown down, Barrel's like, well, I, I, I trusted you, but now, I, now I'm just going to back away. And the Azir safety does make it all good. You can see once KTR set up, it's very easy for them just to push down. Yeah, it almost feels like Nongshim are just electing to take the consolation prize rather than fight it just yet. Which I think, honestly, you're 3,000 gold down. Oh, Sylvie is right here, though. And the control is there as well. And Jiwoo just going to get arrowed down. Melee ult forced. The wall comes in, though. And they are trying to get this knockup into perfect. But the Kasante is so tanky. They can't do anything. Double knockup from Barrel as well. As now in the back line, BDD just going to peel. As down he will go. But Domshim using so much to just take down BDD. And they will pay the price for it. Such a strange end. Well, we're going to try and stop this. But this is a hard ask. Yeah, I don't think this is happening. I mean, he, he doesn't have Leandris. That's a nice knockup, though. Okay, some rocks into death. Flash oh, forward no. and call me. Yeah, getting a little bit over aggressive with that one. Nice try, I suppose. But oh. that's going to be the Baron. He's Go had quite the uh, experience in this one. As Ult is going to hit the Melio. And BDD is nearly dead, as maybe I cursed him. And you nearly going to take him out. BDD just escaping from that. That's perfect. He's got other ideas. Gets the knockup into the... Oh, God! <laughs> he still got pulled in, even after the flash. Why even is this champ? <laughs> How did he manage? Aatrox was updated a lot earlier than Cassante just pulled out. Yeah, true. Uh, the knockup's oh, not going to happen. And now BDD has just got them again. A fish in a barrel. As everybody's going to be swept up here once again. And Sylvie, no difference for him. Def just uh, gliding his way to a quadra kill. Yeah. As easy as that, just feels like Dongshin, you know, after Dungeon going down, they kind of just lost all the wind in their sails. There was definitely moments in this game they put up a decent fight, but quite honestly, just outmatched. Well, Dungeon's got his edge of a night finish. Wait, where'd it go? Wait, where'd it go? Oh, it's gone. Um, yeah, they're just going to throw a Maokai ultimate at him. <laughs> He's just going to leave. He's like, okay, actually, never mind. You guys can end the game. Classic didn't it? Oh, wait, he goes in and uh, gives over a free kill. 
And then the Nexus is gonna go down as KT win 18 to four with the kill score. And the time was like 20 seconds.